Privit ya Ruth. I think a, a lot of what we learn in language we can learn by guessing. And can you guess Ukrainian? Yes. Will you get it wrong sometimes? Sometimes. There are words like cabinet, which means uh, an office rather than a cabinet. Um, but we've got Sonia here today uh, with the pronunciation for us to copy and lots of words that I think you're going to be able to guess these ones here. There's a lot to get through. Let's get started. Here's the first one. Vin student. Vin student. There's the hand. There's the handwriting. Vin student. Vin student. What does it mean? Vin student. Vona studentka. And for the female, Vona studentka. Vin ne ateist. Vin ne ateist. Vin ne at e yist. So that's a yi. What do you think it means? Vin ne ateist. And the feminine version, Vona ateistka. Vona ateistka. Sonia? Vona ateistka. How are you doing? Are you guessing them right? Here's the next one. Vin ne pacient. Ne pacient. Vin ne pacient. What do you think? Vin ne pacient. He looks like a pacient. The feminine version? Vona pacientka. Vona pacientka. Vin journalist. Vin journalist. Vin journalist. Vin journalist. Did you get it? And the feminine version? Vona journalistka. Vona journalistka. Easy to guess words, proving that Ukrainian is not that difficult. Here's the next one. Have a listen. Vin kosmonaut. Ivona kosmonaut. What do you guess it is? Vin kosmonaut. Ivona kosmonaut. Next one. Vin dietolog. Vin dietolog. Vin dietolog. Vin dietolog. What do you think? Vin dietolog. Is that what you thought? Let me know in the comments how you're doing at guessing. Next one. Have a look. Can you guess? Have a listen. Vin ne klient. Avona klientka. What do you think? Have a listen. Vin ne klient, a vona klientka. This one's a lovely one, and I think these two go so nicely together. Have a listen. Vona hippie, i vin shaman. What do you think they mean? Vona hippie, i vin shaman. Vona hippi i vin shaman. Lovely for midsummer. Next one. Have a read of this as much as you can. Here's the script. Here's the handwriting. Here's the Latin script. And then have a listen. Moja mama 
інженер. А тато – механік. Моя мама – інженер. А тато – механік. Моя мама – інженер. А тато – механік. What's your score so far? Am I right? Can you guess Ukrainian? Here's a couple of fun words. Sheriff Ninja. Listen to Sonia say it. Моя мама шериф, а тато ниндзя. Моя мама шериф, а тато ниндзя. I think that's how Sonia says it. And what do you think it means? Моя мама шериф, а тато ниндзя. Look at these letters. Б, юр. Ро, крат, б, юр, ро, б, юр, ро, крат. That T, крат. What do you think it means? It's too easy, isn't it? Він бюрократ. Вона теж бюрократка. Вона менеджер. Вона менеджер. How Sonia says it, it sounds like an English word. Вона менеджер. And he is a favorite of mine. I, I like everything about this. Business lady. Business lady. Look at that D. Okay, Sonia? Vona business lady. Vona business lady. Vona business lady. Another great one coming up. This one. Look at the script. Look at the handwriting. Listen to Sonia. Він не бізнесмен, але джентльмен. Він не бізнесмен, але джентльмен. Він не бізнесмен, але джентльмен. What about this one? Він актор, а вона не актриса. So we've got a nice negative sentence there too. Vona ne actrisa. Vona ne actrisa. And you can guess what it means. Vin actor. A vona ne actrisa. Here we have vona designer i vin. Tesh, vona designer i vin tesh. Tesh. Let's hear Sonia. Vona designer. Oh, Sonia is only saying vona designer. Okay, we have to settle for that. Vona designer. Vona designer. Just roll that R. Next. Вона моя секретарка. Вона моя секретарка. Вона моя секретарка. Вона моя секретарка. Він ваш секретар. Did you guess what moya meant in moya sekretarka? And can you guess what vash means with vin vash sekretar? 
Він ваш секретар. Is that what you guessed? Він ваш секретар. So here we have it again. Я ваш сиколог. Let's hear Sonia. Я ваш психолог. Я ваш психолог. Can you say it? And do you know what it means? Я ваш психолог. Is that what you thought? And now we've got the last couple of words and they're brilliant ones. Look at this. Моя сестра, медсестра. Моя сестра, медсестра. So, this сестра is a sort of cognate from the family group. Моя сестра, мед What does that remind you of? Medical. Сестра. What do you think it means? Моя сестра. Медсестра. Моя сестра. Медсестра. So what about if you have a brother? Ми брат теж мед брат. Брат. Not a cognate, but quite a funny word, meaning brother. Mi brat tež med brat. Two more. Ja pro hram mist. Ja pro hramist. Pro hramist. Ja pro hramist. Can you say it? Do you know what it means? And the last one. Ja hacker. Ja hacker. Ja hacker. Ja hacker. Це моя українська. Це теж ваша українська. Це теж ваша Ukrainska. We learn languages by listening, guessing, and putting them into our vocabulary. Finish. And you can guess some more by watching this video here if you want to do that next.